at the 817 I've taken off I've disconnected the antenna and I've taken off the you know the microphone and let's turn it off and we'll turn it over like so I got the batteries that are in it for actually from Amazon so it's all off disconnected you pull this forward try not to when you pull it forward try not to press on the screen or the buttons you don't want to cause any damage so pull it and then it just flips up okay like so and I can see that it's so easy to break and if you look here um, someone has broken the the tab before I mean you can buy spare doors you know they're not expensive to buy uh, but you can see that that tab's had a bit of super glue on it anyway so here's the batteries like so and it's all turned off and right now if you look here down here you can see there is a green wire tucked right down there be careful we don't short anything out now if we cut that wire apparently it starts to enable the charging or allows you to enable the charging so it's going to see how loose it is i can pull it up through because i do want to put some insulation tape over it if there's a bit of slack there i'll pull it up because these are actually quite fiddly to um you know to get in these 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 batteries right so it looks like we are enable able to do it so you don't want it shorting on the battery case um, so I'm going to take one battery out anyway, just to make sure there isn't a, a, a circuit, you know. So now if we try and turn it on, it's going to not come on. Okay. There you go. So I'm going to snip it and someone's going to say that's the wrong way to do it, but I'm going to snip it anyway. Let's grab my little snips and I, I am going to isolate it, but I'm actually going to test it first. I'll just put some tape over it, so a quick snip. There you go, now let's do it. If, if I've got it wrong, you can actually get these cables. They're not expensive, those cables. And if I've got it wrong, we're soon gonna find out. So now, uh, we still don't need to start charging anything yet. We're gonna put the power supply in, and we're gonna see if it allows me to, to enable charging, and then that'll be, the end of the video and I'll put I'm gonna put a link in the description we're just gonna hold that down that's the power supply now 12 or well, 13.8 well you can see the volts on the screen it says 14 volts so now if I press a no F first then a look starts to charge it didn't do do the double beep so let's get the batteries in there We'll hold down. Mind you, it didn't actually show charging. It just didn't double beep. So what we're gonna do is go go to six hours. Like so. There it is. It's showing the charging thing now. See that? We get the batteries in there now. Let's turn it off. Turn it off. It's showing charging time remaining as well, which we weren't getting before. We're gonna pull this off, put the battery in, and then I'm going to isolate these wires. Um, so let's get it the right way around, like so. I mean, the, the, the ends of them are pretty, like they can't, but you just, if that touches the body, I guess, I'm guessing there's some sort of live in there. They wouldn't be happy about that. I'm going to get a tiny bit of sellotape and just put it over the edge. But I'm just going to show you, if we turn it over and plug in the power, It should, it will do the whole charging remaining thing. Charge time remaining. So it means that no one's ever actually used the batteries in this set. And turn it on. Like so, and you can see it's charging. And then unplug the power. And um, I think the battery, now I'll show you the batteries. Are they flat now? I did put the batteries back in, like so. I noticed that I did have to fiddle them a bit because before the thing turned on. They are 2,800 milliamp hours by eBay and they were on eBay. 
So hopefully that's fine. What I want to see, to be honest with you, is I want to see the radio actually turn on on the battery power, which at the moment it's not doing. So we'll turn it off and we'll just wait for a while. Thanks for watching my channel. If I've done anything wrong, let me know. Bye for now, 7-3, all the best.